with its diverse culture, distinct religious faiths, tough geographical and ecological conditions, conduction of elections in the state of Uttarakhand is a tedious task. Out of 11,697 polling booths, 262 are to be reached after covering a distance of more than 5 kilometers on foot. Polling parties have to cover several kilometers of arduous journey over snowy roads to reach differently abled and 80 plus electors for the postal ballot and general voting. Even amidst rough and adverse conditions, the state of Uttarakhand is ready to participate in the festival of democracy Uttarakhand Chunav Kothig along with its 81,72,000 voters. Presently we are at booth number 79 which is in the Central School Hathibakala of Masuri Legislative Assembly of Dehradun. This is a model Sakhi booth, where all the election processed is managed by female personals. Sri Naresh Durgapal, returning officer and members of polling party, are briefing the agents of political parties about the process of mock poll in which the agents are being asked to cast equal number of votes and verify the result through VVPAT to check the reliability of EVM before actual poll. This process is mandatorily done at all the polling booths. All the polling booths are properly sanitized. Thermal scanning is being done at the booth entrance. COVID protocol is strictly followed by giving gloves to the electors, providing masks and maintaining social distancing. A special desk has been set up for the differently abled voters. There is a provision of wheelchair and walking sticks. Volunteers are also deployed for assisting the differently abled voters. The aged and differently abled people are being taken to booth at the earliest possible to refrain them from waiting. Separate waiting rooms are set for male and female voters. For lactating mothers, Separate feeding room with cradle has also been made, having all the arrangements that are needed. Chief Electoral Officer Uttarakhand Srimati Saujanya informed, uh, This is our Sakhi booth. Uh, this is uh, one of the booths wherein all the presiding officer, polling officer 1, 2 and 3 are uh, lady officers. So uh, this is uh, to give encouragement for uh, women that uh, they are not only voters but also can effectively handle the entire process uh, of voting. Uh, in any uh, election, the most cardinal uh, uh, important person would be the presiding officer because he is the head of the entire uh, uh, proceedings that happen in a particular booth. So the initiation has uh, taken now to, uh, to make 100 uh, booths all over Uttarakhand which are uh, totally handled uh, by women. So uh, here uh, they have also created facilities for women voters. When the women voters come, if they are <coughs> with children, so there is a creche facility available. There are uh, ladies from the Anganwadi Women and Child Department who are facilitating uh, stay of the uh, ladies. All assured minimum facilities like the ramp and electricity, toilets and water is also uh, present in this booth. Separate queues have been set for male and female voters outside the voting room. As the polling process starts and voter enters into the voting room, the polling officer first calls the name of the voter aloud so that the party agents can identify the voter or raise objections, if any. The second polling officer gets voter's signature. The third polling officer applies indelible ink on the index finger and then the voter is asked to proceed for casting his or her vote. This process is followed with every voter. At the end of the day, the presiding officer declares that the polling time is over. The EVM is sealed in the presence of agents of contesting parties. Agents also put their seal and signature. The polling process is conducted with total integrity, honesty, and utmost fairness. Every officer or employee involved in the election process ascertained that there is an ambience of easiness and festivity while the serious electoral process is conducted. Every voter leaves the booth with a sense of pride for having contributing his or her share to strengthen the pillars of democracy. The views of the voters at polling booths are a testimony to our effort. Oh, it was very good. These are very all together different kind of experience this time.